Uh, also, we bitches. are in trouble. Why's that? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> this uh, is unintended. This well. is not a feature. So welcome back to Kerbal Space Program and uh, Kerbal Space Program English and take two of what is my launch to the Moon Base. Um, we are launching a Moon Base because why do anything other on our second trip to the Moon than than build a base? Why not? Uh, we're here with Lisa, Cody, and Bobby, and you'll have already seen the first clip of why it went horribly wrong due to a center of gravity imbalance and memes. So let's get ourselves planned for our uh, <laughs> uh, trip back again. Needing mech of course, for the not causing mass breakages of rockets because which would never happen That's oh never no no no, no. well th they've already seen it technically in the way this is going to work they'll have seen that helter skelter of, of, of problems um so yeah that was that was interesting i'll give it credit um i learned a valuable lesson i i didn't good but either way we'll see if this works I was this lying. time oh we're launching the cotex 2.0 we are launching Cotex 2.0, or as I've named it officially, Bandcamp 1. Leaving the map. <laughs> yes. That looks like something you would see at a Bandcamp. It does, yeah. Oh, I've no. been to Bandcamp several times, I can't confirm. Absolutely. Well, it's a, it's a moon base, so I was thinking, you know what, base camp, you know, we've got the Space Winnebago, the Space Caravan. Well, this is, because it's a base, it's now Space Camp. Space but we can't base. call it Space Camp, we have to call it the the... In this case, I always wanted to get it a space camp. Yeah. So this launch should be, in theory, more successful. Not spinning we're... yet. No. There's still time. Okay, so we're dropping throttle even further because otherwise, large problemos. Big spinning spin energy. All right, we should still have our engines this time when the because we lost control last time when the the boosters separated. So that shouldn't be a problem still, I hope. I love that smoke trail there from the booster engines. It's very pretty. Oh yeah, that is huge. It's like blowing smoke rings. Okay, we're going up now. We're starting to get rather warm. Thankfully, the boosters are about to separate off. Hopefully, successfully this time. Engage spinning spin. We're on target still. Successful separation of booster stage. Nice. Okay, and we're still tracking on target at the moment. Everything is uh, fine. Okay, so engines are still responsive. We're down to 40% throttle to maintain our pitch. We are pitching over a bit here. I'm not sure whether that's intended. We're still on correct profile, so we're good. Engines are responsive and burning, so we've not broken the ship yet. Which is a good start. We can only pray. We, we, we can. We really can. But we should be okay. I just have to hope that we don't do anything else stupid. Fingers crossed. Indeed, yeah. yeah. Okay, so our ellipsis right now is going to pass up to 88. So we're going to throttle up again now as we're leaving the atmosphere. No, we can't go to 110%, but we'll go to 100% because why not? We can afford to. Yeah. We're out the atmosphere now. You do what you want. You're an adult. I know, yeah. Okay, so... No aerodynamic pressures, so we're good. I don't want to deploy that till we're fully out of the atmosphere, though. So I am concerned... About what? About it coming away. Okay, so this is good. We're about to coast. 
coasting initiated. From coast to coast, a space ghost. I love space ghosts, though. Uh, let's see. Okay, so our next node is six minutes, so... We should be able to deploy this now safely. Yep, we're in I zero G, so it's space. deployed safely. We have safe deployment, and you can finally oh. see the moon base and its space sky crane. Yes, we have a space sky crane here. Oh no. We do. I'm disappointed. Aim camera. Okay, so our I space don't see Zora sky X, crane so I'm is this. This X here is our sky crane. This is our lander, essentially. This is what will basically, once it gets to the moon orbit, disconnect from here float around to here, hook up there, and we'll go downwards using those four engines and land it. It makes total sense. I totally get it. It's a good job, so yes, so we can actually flip it in the right direction because we have an extra stage still here we don't need to get rid of. And apparently not enough power to move it. Modern propellant, however, is ridiculous right now, so we can afford to try. Well, I mean, this is going way better than the last, so, I mean, why it not? It is already, yeah. Look at all the junk I'm going into space. Yeah, okay. so, I have a question. Go ahead. Who pays for all the boosters that disengage and fall on people's houses? Elon Kerman, from his personal uh, grown-up reading material collection. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He uses his uh, very rare first editions of grown-up comics um, to pay for... Um, all the funding for Gerbex. Private Enterprise, so... Yep. And Kerbals have long since learned not to live downrange of the Gerbex facility. It is just safer. I... I'm thinking I might just ditch this already because this feels ridiculous. I mean... Mm. It's rad. Keep it. Yeah, but it's way too big. I've just got SSTO by accident again by having way too much fuel. I mean, just burn it, baby. Burn, baby. Burn. And we'll be burning here to kind of pop this back out the other side. And it is slowly trying to maneuver, so let's give it an assist. It's trying to position, but it's too heavy. So, yep. Yeah. Bye, bye, bye. Backstreet Boys time. Bye, 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 bye. Yeah, so we should be way more manoeuvrable now. We just don't need that. We've got more than enough motion lotion here to do it. Mm. Oh. Yes, that's the thing. I liked it when you went spinny spin and blew up. So, no, I didn't know, <laughs> weirdly enough. I, I didn't. Um, engine is enabled and ready to roll. So booster stage is separated. We're coming through to our position now, so it's manoeuvring properly at the moment. So this is actually our moon base here. We'll be adding more modules as we go. But for now, that is our moon base. So how is arrays. it being built? Is it being built in orbit? And then no. landing? It's being landed here. You'll see. Once we get there, this X section will separate off. This obviously goes away. The X section will hook up to the top there and lower it down. Acting like a sky crane. That sounds excellent. It sounds incredibly problematic. So we'll see if it's successful. It goes as well as it did the other time. Yeah, it could go worse. I'm not gonna lie. Well, well I've just left a worse. massive. Um, this, with its current trajectory, should re-enter, so that shouldn't be a problem for us. So that's still suborbital. So this is burning for circularization. We'll look at our fuel burn and see how we're gonna do. But we should be all right. This is a vac optimized engine, so we should be fine. Okay, so this does look very strange. Wait till you see the uh, the Duna conveyor. That thing is insane. What's that? Oh, that's well, uh, that's a bit close. Oh, that's my station. Okay, that's a uh, space caravan down there. We're seeing. Passing just above it. So, the mute. Uh, good to go here. We should be circularized in orbit. Now. Oh no, it's trying to correct. Okay, that doesn't matter. Okay, so we'll disable that. We'll enable stability assist. We'll go prograde here. We'll get rid of this. Now we'll plan our maneuver. So we need to go to the map. 
set as target. What's that? The uh, band camp debris. Okay, that's fine. Abandoned where is band camp. camp. Abandoned no. camp debris. I'm confused. I can't see where band camp is. Oh, here it is. I just zoomed out ridiculously somehow. Okay. Um, so we're an autonomous vessel right now. So we're going to do our uh, maneuver planner. So we need to go to. I'm sure I will know which one this is at some point. Home and transfer to target. Okay. Uh, create and execute. We should be good to go. So 28 minutes for our maneuver. So we're going to do another orbit first. All just zippity zip zaps up through there. So the time is down a bit. This is going so well. It kind of is, actually. Minus that explosion, but we won't talk about that. Well, that explosion was the first time, okay? That wasn't necessarily This wasn't canon. Needed. So yeah. what you're saying is the first time always results in, you know, explosions. Yes. Okay, so the burn should be happening now. So once we're in position here, which should be any second, we'll be going to burn. I don't know what you mean, Bobby. So since we're <laughs> up with our execution path here, we should be good to go. Mun is 12 o'clock. And it's time to go fire those engines. Burn so, paper. no more premature explosion. Got it. That is the intent. Whether that ends up being the execution is another matter entirely. I believe in you. I don't. I always believe in you. Okay, we're going. So obviously we're kind of doing a curved pathway because that's the way orbits work. So we'll be heading out this way and coming round and intercepting the moon. So our burn is about three minutes long. We've got 700 meters per second to use. And we should be just fine. Meter, but I hardly know her. Okay, so we have a total of 2,000 meters per second in the whole rocket. We have 1,000 left in the thing, but 600 we need. So we'll have 400 uh, meters per second left to use to actually circularize in the moon. That's plenty. Obviously, we have spare motion lotion up here in the actual drone lander. This is weird enough, a long gas burn, because this first section of it takes forever, then it'll go whoop. It's a long part of it, isn't it? It's a really long one, yeah. It takes ages to go for this first segment, then suddenly it starts to rapidly speed up. So you'll see how quickly it's going now as it expands, you can see mm -hmm. it moving faster and faster. Yep. There she goes. It just means we have to burn the engine for a long time. Burn. Okay, we're looking good. We're on target to have 400 meters per second of delta V left. So that's not implausible. We should be okay. If all else fails, the lander can stop us because that's got quite a bit of... Yeah, it's going faster now. A little bit faster now. Yeah. Um, we are rapidly leaving Kerbin. I liked Kerbin. By the way, you know, here's a, um, a fun fact for you in terms of space. The engines they use in the Expanse TV show, how they burn basically halfway there and flip around and break the rest of the way. Yes. Giving them 1G in the spacecraft. Um, we could go to Mars if we basically had enough fuel, or a more efficient fuel, that we could burn for 19 hours and then flip and burn for 19 more. We could go to Mars in 32 hours. Damn. Like, literally, with the current technology we have, if we had an efficient enough fuel, or we had a um, a fuel that basically would allow us to burn it for that long or carry that much without it being too heavy, we could literally go to Mars in about wow. two days. Yeah, we could go in two days. It'll be like getting a taxi. Cool. Yeah. And you'd have technically gravity on the trip. For what essentially cool. be a long weekend in space. I would That'd watch be freaking that. cool. Okay, so, so you're saying I should leave the planet? Though. No, I want to go first. I would love to go to Mars, oh. actually. Oh. 
Okay, so we're definitely. coming up on our end of our burn now. 10 seconds to enter and cut off. Yeah, see, look how fast that's going now. We'll have our intercept here. Chico, spanny span. Uh huh. Suggesting we're a little late for intercept. But we're okay. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. So stability assist is on. We're going to point prograde. And we're going to go. Time to go this way real fast. Because we don't want to hang around and watch. We'll do our capture manually because it's not that hard. Throw on the hunt. It's the purple it orbit. Indeed. That is our projected. That's uh, our current orbital pathway, essentially, if we don't intercept and pick it up. Okay. So once this goes a little closer, we should intercept lunar orbit. And there's the lander from the Diner Explorer. Uh, still in orbit. Memories. So we're on the same plane here. So this should flip over to Mun Influence. There we go. And we have a great oh, periapsis of 44,000 meters there. So we need to flip around to be retrograde here because we're going to burn to circularize. So this mission's actually really on track so far. Like, yeah. Surprisingly on track. We're doing good. Um, let's flip this bitch around. We're running low on electric charge, though. That could be, for now, manually combated. I'll have to put those in when we actually descend. But we can recharge our batteries pretty darn quick here. These are for deployment when we're on the surface, technically. But they'll help stock the tanks for the time being. So we will go zoop do doop do doop do 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 Behind the moon we're gonna go. Yeah. Okay, back to one. So we'll go... All the way here. The hell? Don't <laughs> mind me. I understood. What's your problem? I didn't understand. It was like Hammond speak. Leave me alone. That's why I understand. Okay, so we're flipping retrograde, oh, nice. and we're going to burn to circularize here once we're level. Okay. Burning to circularize. We should have spare here, actually, if my calculations are correct, which are based on no calculations at all. But I real hope that it will work out just fine. Yeah. I have faith. Everything's I going don't. great. What could go wrong? Everything? I mean, we are running low on fuel, but we're, in, we're actually officially in orbit now, so we're technically succeeded. But I need this to come down significantly, so we've got an actual reasonable periapsis, which will become our new positioning once this flips around. Fuel's still good. I may have just calculated perfectly to where Weist will be proud of me. But, I, but I'm always proud okay, of you. Okay, so we're calculating down here. I'm going to drop this to about 10. And we have just enough fuel. If this can get... Oh my god. Look at the fuel level. Oh. I almost planned this perfectly. Because that's useless now. We can get rid of that. Hi. Time for our most complicated maneuver. Which is going to involve me putting these away temporarily. So I'll need to maneuver. So you can get yeeted. Actually, what's our propellant level? Full. Okay. Okay. Um, GTFO. Thanks. Okay. Um, time to maneuver a very cumbersome spacecraft. Is it a radical maneuver? Relatively, yeah. Um, Sick. Let's hope this actually disconnects. Otherwise, this will be for nothing. Yeah. Okay. Um, I have a guest visitor. <gasps> well, hello. So he's quite the happy boy right now. Well, hi. Yeah, oh, God. Stuff's freaking out. We're okay. We're okay. Um, so, I need to go... Up. Oh. 
arrest our spin. Uh, I'm doing it. <laughs> why are you doing this? Are you okay. making an acrobatic check? Uh, my acrobatic check has been failed. Why are you spinning? Oh, it's trying to put retrograde. That's why. Uh, okay, I've, I've cocked this up horribly. Um, control from here. Okay, we want to go to that. So that is target. I'm going to let's do this automatically because I'm kind of cocking this up now. So, god damn it, get back here. Aim camera here. So we should be arresting our speed now and positioning. I hope. Yeah? I, I believe. I think it's going to be I, fine. I, I, I don't. I mean, it's, it's entirely plausible we will screw this up. Listen, it's, it's going to be okay. Y yes, you say that, but um, I know we're it. currently going further away, and that's going down. So there's a problem. That's a feature. Okay, so we're on take two now of the Mun trip. I've literally just flown all the way back here because I did the screw up. I did not have enough RCS Question. nozzles that were in the right places, so we did a stupid yes. Do we not count this incident? <laughs> take three. Okay, take three. You know what, Rachel? Three is a magic number. It is. That's it really three is. Threes. So I'm going to engage these now. And we're just going to push away from the booster stage. Right, well, I thought actually, it was. When you actually land this, is it going to stick upwards like a tower? No. You'll see. Um, okay, I need to retract these now because we have to actually begin maneuvering. They'll be in the way. So, um, why have I not got the ability to control anything? Okay, now I do. So, we'll just push away from that section. In fact, we're going to flip this thing radial out so we can see what the hell we're doing so this way this is facing the sun you will see exactly what our magical contraption is about to do now so to make my life marginally easier i can actually i'm going to attempt to at least position this properly before i use the magic oh fuck button of the docking system so uh control from here oh god no no mm, that was too soon uh close enough and that'll be... Okay, we can't select that yet. This is fine. Yeah, this is normal. So we'll just flip this round. Okay, we're good to go. Okay, so now we separate. Okay, we have separation. And I just dropped my vape pen off my desk. So, I now need to carefully nudge away, which will be... This way. There she goes. Oh, look at that beauty. Behold. Okay, it's still in target mode. That's why it's being weird. Okay, so... Okay, so this should be relatively easy, in theory. Oh, so it won't be easy then. Could be. We don't know. Listen, it can't be worse than the first theory. <laughs> I now have the ability to go forwards and backwards, so we're already on a plus. Yeah, she can go spinny spin on manual, not on accident. Yes. I now actually at least roughly know what I'm doing right now. You know more than me. 
same. Purple Space Program, Fidget Spinner Edition. <laughs> <laughs> this is going great. This is gonna be fine. You know, I'm just gonna give it autopilot yes. control because I want to make sure this happens right this time. So we're <laughs> gonna position underneath here. And the magic truly begins as soon as we couple up. And you'll see our major plan. Which is totally working now because I can actually go up and down thanks to the addition of those RCS <laughs> nozzles on top and bottom. And it's maneuvering just fine. And we can see what's going on now. I will need to rotate this so we don't have any engine com conflicts. So I'll just spin it now. I don't want to burn the, the actual pod. So I need the engines to be diagonally, two on each side. Okay, we're good. Manually controlling the yaw of the craft so we don't actually get conflict here. Yeah, this is totally unmanned, by the way. This is controlled by a probe core and antenna. So we're on approach now. Hot. Actually, no. Modern propellant uh, thrusters are cold gas thrusters, so... Huh. It's actually really cold. There you go. Okay, positioning now. Okay, and we should be coming in a little bit sooner. I think. I thank you, Gathy, sweetheart. How did we go from being astronauts to rednecks? I, I, I don't know. I don't but, understand. Uh, well, he's approaching the spaceship and we're going to do some docking. Better dock it now. Yeah. Like Futurama, we're, we're going to be farming on the moon. We will be. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> I'm just hoping this actually happens at some point. We're whalers on the moon. We carry a <laughs> Oh, no. We are Come slowly on, approaching the craft so now. So once it's over the top, we should be able to start moving in. I think there's a slight amount of yaw here, so... You're on the actual base rather than the actual lander. I need to practice my orbital maneuvering, so I'll be doing that at some point. But for now, I'm just going to settle for getting there. Come on. That's it. Some manual control here. Go for it, man. Come on. That's it. You can do it. Come on, computer. Don't be special. You can do it. Special. It's backing oh, me away no. for an ungod known reason. Now we're coming in again. So, so, okay, so I've managed to get it to actually connect now. So, this could be a hot connection. Uh, what does that mean? Does it mean you're about to blow this, this up? The diplomatic phrase for oh. really freaking quick. Oh! But we have connection. We have connection. That's you did it. We well, did last it. Last time you did it really okay. quick. You had that premature explosion. Now come on. Okay, so let's deploy all the landing legs. And it is time. To position the craft. Oh my god, this is a pig carrying this thing. Yes. Oh. We need to point retrograde. <laughs> but would it be able to carry me? That's the question. It looks like a cargo bomb. Oh, we need to control from a here now. Bit. So we need to flip around this way. It basically is. Science rules. It does. That looks amazing. Okay. Um, in fact, we'll do a manual save as well. In case of whoops. <laughs> you never know when a whoops can happen. They always happen. 
Let's begin burning. So we have our touchdown spot. And it's time to start our slowing process. This all should work in theory. <laughs> gonna be fine. You, 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 you think that, yeah. You think that. I know it. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Believe in me. Believe in you. This is really ungainly when it's got this thing attached to it. I still believe in you. Okay, we're gonna fast forward oh, some time oh, here. Man. Start our approach. Okay, so we're at 10,000 meters coming down. Let's begin our descent. Oh, this could be interesting. This is not a well-designed spaceship. But it looks Or, really or it is. Cool. It's either very poorly designed or incredibly well designed. I'm not sure which. That all just depends on how it works out. It does, yeah. We're not overheating the structure because of the way I designed this, so that's a benefit. And we have way more fuel than I bargained for. Also useful. Okay, speed is coming down good. I believe right now we're looking at the crater up ahead. We're on full burn now for descent. Speed's coming down well. Need to leave this on full burn. But we will be making it. <gasps> okay, about to approach 100 meters a second. And that's when we'll cut the engines for now. A bit more burning. You do love your fire. Uh-huh. I'm going to have to pick the speed up here because I need to lift up and maneuver. Oh, God. Yeah, we're coming in hot. We're coming in hot. Um, oh, good God. We might stop. Oh, shit. You got oh, this. This is so close. Got this. Got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. What a view. But Land this space spider. <laughs> yes! God damn it. Got it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we have touched down. I kind of want to move it a bit. F5. Uh, <laughs> this this could be fine. Rachel, no. Don't, don't, no. Rachel! <laughs> Kaboom! Remember the first time you landed on the moon? Yes, it's fine. I promise. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you said that that time, too. Try to land in the crater. No, I just want to move ourselves a bit further forwards. A little flatter. Yeah. We have the speed control. We should be fine. Oh god, we don't have the speed control. Remember the first time you landed on the moon? Yep. Yep. The. Uh... <laughs> that here. That's. This is different. <laughs> um, um, uh, well, I this like is fine. This is going. This I, is I fine. Like this I think is it going. might be okay. <laughs> it might be okay. It might. It might not be okay. 
That's definitely not okay. It's we're okay. Be... We're okay. Right? She's okay. She just wanted what? to move. She said she was gonna move. That's what she did. I did. did. Uh -huh. I did. Mm -hmm. We're fine. We're fine. Okay? We're fine. Move the very wrong direction. We're fine. We're fine. And we moved the right way, actually. Mm -hmm. Mother mm -hmm. We moved the right way. Hey, Spider-1. Mountain down. Into the side of that mountain. <laughs> We're actually... Maybe. We might be the first C-Fit event on the moon, okay? <laughs> okay, we're descending still. We're slowing. This is not very flat, but I will take it. She wanted to move to a flat. I'm going so far sideways. Oh God damn it, Rachel. God. Rachel, I just want to take a moment to remind you that you triggered me. Uh-huh, anyway. me too. Maybe we'll stop moving eventually. It's fine, I promise, okay? I, I don't believe you. It is fine. It's alright, uh, she's just gonna land on the side of a cliff. As soon as I work on <laughs> my controls are again. <laughs> oh, this is like an out of control hot air balloon, leave me alone, okay? It's fine. What a great I... balloon, it's flat. Have I got enough RCS? I'm out of monopropellant. That's why I can't maneuver it. Uh, <laughs> so we're going down wherever this bitch wants to stop, basically. The side of that mountain. It's gonna be great. No, it's not gonna be there. No, it won't be. It's pretty close. It'll be just shy, yeah. Problem is, we're moving quite well laterally. You're still not gonna be on flat land. Does that trigger you? It'll do, it'll do, it'll do. I hope. It'll do. I just gotta hope, okay? I got us to hope. They've got stuff. Roll a d20 for a, uh... Would this be a dexterity save? Yep. Uh, with disadvantage. <laughs> We're making a slightly rolling landing. <laughs> God. Hope the spider tumbles. Cock! Oh, <laughs> no! Cody, no! <laughs> God damn it. Then he's uh, uh, it, it's, okay, it, it, it's it's still mostly intact, and it now stopped. Oh, and I the first time we went to the moon, and and it never happened. Okay, what are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> it never happened because look, we landed. Oh yeah, we landed. <laughs> totally not the fourteenth try. Yeah. yeah. Shut strange. up. Okay, now I need to move this. So shush. I had a strange dream, you guys. Rachel oh. got owned. <laughs> I think we all had that dream. I don't think it was a dream. I think it was a reality. And it's been touched down like it was meant to. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Everything. Now traveling to Horizon Where... Lunar Colony. Yes, okay. <laughs> And I can get rid of this. Oh. Prepare to attack. Oh, shush. Oh, no. I wanna okay, so I'm going to have to get Kerbals here before we can deploy anything that's on it. So the next mission will be bringing Kerbals to our newly landed moon base with a view of can a huge crater. Can coffee next time? Yes, it can. It's great. This is great. This is fine. This is fantastic. This is exactly oh. as intended, okay? Yeah, I know. Well, we're here. I will wrap this one up because this has taken forever now due to the multiple fixes due to my idiocy. Um, but I'm sure you all enjoyed me s crashing. But uh, that wasn't I did. Boom base. I enjoyed Either way, crashing. successful. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.